Well, that groundhog wasn't kidding when he predicted we'd have six more weeks of winter. Last night's latest snowstorm had motorists in Billings digging out, scraping ice, and pretty much sliding their way across town this morning. With temperatures just below freezing last night, the rude awakening this morning was a slushy, icy mess. Six inches of new snow fell overnight at the Billings Airport, but in some of the nearby communities, nearly double that amount of snow. So much snow, in fact, that this winter is stacking up to be one of the snowiest on record, and it is showing no signs of letting up. Private plows working for the city of Billings uh, again, uh, out working to clear the residential streets at this hour. CMG construction crews uh, started their work this time in Area 1, which is north of Poly Drive, up Zimmerman Trail, and out, including the Iron Horse subdivision. From there, plows will move to the height zone 6 and work their way through the remaining parts of the city. They'll finish up in Area 2, which is south of Poly Drive to Broadwater Avenue. Whether it was the interstate, the side streets, or the main streets, that deep snow this morning made for a rough ride. Take a look. This picture from the Montana Highway Patrol shows all the accidents troopers responded to from midnight through 5 o'clock this afternoon. That's at least 83 incidents across this region. A majority of them slide-offs. Q2 Sports Director Scott Breen snapping these photos as he was out braving the roads this morning. First this along I-90 between Billings and Laurel. Then uh, another slide off off the Duck Creek Road. And as you saw in that first picture, right in front of the Ben Steele Middle School was a rough sledding for many motorists around town. Motorists also posted on Facebook pleading for help to pull them from ditches, berms, and even to help them get up some of the steeper hills around town.